Welcome back guys to another episode of The Witcher 3. Here we go boys. We are going to learn the fundamentals Should work of on combat. the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals. And Ciri's barely a novice. Let's do it. Look at that sexy sword right there. Hell yeah. Alright, so for combat. Witchers must be prepared to fight foes of all kinds. Be they plaid or plate-clad knights, ethereal wraiths, or bone-crushing giants. To match the strengths and exploit the weaknesses of different enemies, witchers need to use a variety of weapons and combat techniques. The core tools of their trade are swords. One steel for fighting humans and non-humans, the other silver for slaying monsters. Wow, that's pretty intense. Witchers also have mastered a simple form of combat magic. These signs are not as powerful as the spells wielded by mages, but they can be cast very quickly with simple one-handed gestures, making them quite useful in the heat of combat. Witchers also adept uh, in basic alchemy. They can brew powerful potions, blade oils, and bombs, all of which can the king advantage when fighting stronger or faster foes. All right, so let's draw our sword. Uh, press one to draw your steel sword, or to she that press C. Selecting targets. Press Z to select or deselect a target. When you have a target selected, all your attacks are directed towards it. You don't have to select the target during combat, but doing so can help you focus on a specific opponent. All right, so we uh, removed our sword. We selected him. We mount a fast attack against Vesemir by pressing forward. Nice. All right. A strong attack by holding left shift and pressing this. Wow. Nice. One more. Position, Siri. Footwork. Remember. All right. To dodge to one side, indicate a direction using S, W, left or right, and press Alt. All right. So we're gonna say that. Solid. Rolling. To roll out of the way of a blow, choose direction and press space. Very solid. I think that's what we're going to use more. Oh. What am I supposed to parry? I'm fighting a stupid dummy. Now, live later. Repost! All right, Strike. so that's our basic defense. Counterattack. Counter Press right mouse button just before your opponent strikes to perform a counterattack. Nice. <laughs> that's going to be pretty useful. We can kind of stop them and then start up a combo. Oh, young lady. Bring the day Press to tab to open the quick access menu. Uh, activate the Quinn sign. Select the Quinn sign and press that, whatever Quinn is. It's a protective shield. Okay, so cast, press Q. Siri, Quinn is sometimes called the Witch's Shield. Now watch carefully to see why. Wow! The Quinn sign protects against damage and certain critical effects. Nice. Cast Igni, Garrow. Cool. I want to see sparks fly. Igni. All right, so Igni deals fire damage. Sweet. Wow. For the Quen sign, I'd be a flame by now. Sorry, Geralt. Come on. Telekinetic blast. See that, Siri? Hard will knock any Stuns opponents in some cases, knocks them to the ground. Time for Axie. Damn it. I hate this feeling. Okay, what's Axie? Influences opponent's minds. Uh, Axie can really muddle your mind. Disorient your opponent. Sweet! So we've got fire, we've got a shield, Better we've got sure a telekinetic go. blast and a fire blast. And then also a magic trap. Had enough. See this, Siri? Slows him down. Inside of it. Don't worry, Siri. Quinn will dampen the blow. What is this? Training bomb. Alright, step back and throw a bomb at Vesemir by pressing the middle mouse button. 
I'm pressing it. Uh, it's not letting me press it. Stop showing so we're gonna, we're actually gonna bind that to a different key. Hold on, we're gonna go to options, key bindings. Um, use quick access item, let's just say R. by the minimap. All right, we're gonna go over here. Hold R and aim at one of the highlighted training posts, then release to throw a bomb. Nice, free training. The combat tutorial is now over. If you want, you can continue training with Vesemir. Stop training. Simply sheathe your sword by pressing the Not your lucky Enough. day. Continue right. training at will. Oops. Oh shit. Damn it. I'm gonna try to get used to it a little bit. Alright. That's good enough for me. Oh, whoa, that was a cheap shot right there. Here goes the head. That was impressive. <laughs> Whoa! You really showed him, kid. Siri, get down here. <laughs> she's a little free runner. She devil. Soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Care Morhen. Find that helmet. Siri. Make sure to find every last blade for you. What that? Oh! What the hell? So that was in the past, and now we're in the present. So he killed our Siri. Tamiria rode to Vizima. May 1272. You alright? <laughs> Had a nightmare. About? It'd take forever to explain. Well, maybe it didn't actually happen, I don't know. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in the tub, and next to me... Triss? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seemed so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. We'll find her. In the dream, I went and found Ciri. And then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she-devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. The Wild Hunt appeared, attacked Ciri, 
I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri'd appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She okay, was so that danger. didn't actually happen. That's good. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. It's time to go. Be dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop oh, so Yennefer is that badass with the, the crow we saw right at the very start. Oh, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. They must meet soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. Certain situations. <laughs> The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. <laughs> How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait. Hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Oh shit! Ghouls. Ghouls! Monsters. Life on the continent and in the Skillage Isles is nasty, brutish, and short. War lays waste the land, and those that spare uh, spares lies in countless monsters lurking outside every town and village. Monsters shown with the silver health bar above their heads, indicating to fight them with your silver sword. Alright, so we have our silver sword out. <laughs> Hell yeah, baby. Lock his attack. Go back at him. Oh, there goes ahead. Come at me, bro. Try a heavy. These guys were pretty easy. Adrenaline points. Striking opponents generates adrenaline points. Certain abilities you can acquire allow you to perform special attacks. The require and consume adrenaline points. Your adrenaline points later decline when you are not engaged in combat. Of course, combat. when armies pass, necrophages follow. Vitality cool. regeneration. You can regenerate vitality by eating or drinking or by meditating for at least one hour. Note, while playing the Blood and Broken Bones, Death March to the level of meditation does not regenerate vitality. Food and drink can be placed in your consumable slots for quick use during combat. Press none or F to consume them and regenerate vitality. You have some food equipped in your upper consumable spot. Press none not to eat it and regenerate a portion of your vitality. Okay, so we got that. We're going to press X to call our horse. Ooh, just like Red Dead Redemption. Roach, what's up, homie? Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Right. Horses. About how useful they Witchers are spend most of the time on the road in search of the next contract. They must trek across wide valleys, climb over high mountain peaks, and charge through thick bogs. Luckily, Geralt can always count his horse Roach to help him in his travels. All right. Well, I hope nothing bad happens to Roach. That would be really, really because sad. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no. Because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him, too. His theory collapsed. Move it! Alright, so we're gonna gallop here! War is not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Temeria and Edirne are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. 
believe that. Gotta believe something. That's what keeps us going. What just happened? This horse stopped. Sometime later. Uh oh. We going? What is this? Help me! Help! What the hell is this thing? Is it a lion bird? What the f Just picks up the horse and takes it away. What? Oh my gosh. Has it gone? Yeah. Come out. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. Mm. You don't owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there, muddled. You seek someone? Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But... There's an inn here in White Orchard. Sole one around. Gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? So he paid us after all. Nice! Besides, the innkeep's my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye. Nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. All right. Let's go, uh... Let's go to the inn and get some wine, boys. Run. Right. 